you have fun or what? Good. <laughs> All right. They're going to pick up speed. Here they come. Green flag over racing. And it's Beinleck and Beldowski. Beldowski getting out to the big early lead as Beinleck kind of went inside. He went outside. He's in the middle now as the Harvester is going to try to get around him. Keep an eye on Hacksaw Pat Heaney in that 57 Chef by a landslide. Last race, we'll see if he's got something in that car for these other ones. And it's going to be Beldowski this time by. And then the 11 car. Followed by Jumpin' Joe Darnell, Mark Beinlich, and then Hacksaw Pat Heaney, Kevin Memoli, Kurt Neiswanger, and Dan Moffitt. So the 11 car right there with the 36 of Beldowski. And now it's the 11 car. Looking to challenge for the, he was on the inside, now he's on the outside. As the 81 of Dan Moffat having nothing but problems tonight in that 81 machine. All right, now the 11 looking to challenge the 36 of Beldowski. The 11 looking to the inside of Beldowski. It's Beldowski. It's the 11 car. That's the battle for the lead. A little bit of backfire coming out of the 11 car. As they're going to run into lap traffic and pass Kevin Memoli now. Jumping Joe Darnell currently running third place in that one car. And now it's the 11 to challenge Beldowski again. He's right there. He said, oh, he's got a lot of backfire coming out of the 11 car. Here goes the 11 to try to pass Beldowski now. They're like back and forth, back and forth, lap traffic now. He's right there. All right. Here comes your winner. Who's it going to be? It's going to be Beldowski. Followed by the 11, followed by Jumpin' Joe Darnell. Here comes Memoli. And there goes the hacksaw. Rockford Speedway, what do you think about those vintage outlaw cars? Mark Beinlich in the 17, driving a 1965 Ford Galaxy. So we've got two winners here. One for the Stocker Division and one for the Outlaw Division. This is your winner in the Outlaw Division. They're going to send the 57 car out. Hacksaw Pat Heaney is the winner of the Stocker Division. Sponsored by SNH Auto Repair. A lot of other sponsors. You people know who this is. No stranger to Victory Lane whatsoever. 
S&M Competition Engines, Murray's Auto Salvage. It's got the Grim Reaper on the front of it. As he's going to get out of the car. Make some noise, it's fearless. Frank Beldowski. Frank, come on over here. Haven't got to talk to you in quite a while. Congratulations, sir. Glad to have you back at Rockford, Illinois here. I know you've been running your late model, a lot of different tracks. We got to see out here earlier this year, if I remember right. How did it feel to drive this kind of car, and what year is the body style on this car? This is a 1970 Camaro. Underneath is a, a limited late, old, old limited late chassis. It's the outlaw class, so kind of bring it out. Got it out on Tuesday out of the trailer finally and bring it out, get it ready, have some fun. We, we couldn't figure out who the 11 was. I, I never got his name. We didn't have it. So we, were, we called him the mystery driver. I don't know who's in the 11, but he gave you or she gave you a great race tonight. They were right there. Every time you'd go into turn one, bam, he's right on the inside looking to make a move again. Definitely kept the pressure on you. It's got to be fun racing, good, clean racing as well. You got anybody you want to thank? Uh, we got to thank, thank Keith with SNH Automotive, uh, Kevin with KNV Hardwood. You know, if it wasn't for those guys, we wouldn't be out playing. So I just got to thank them, my uncle, my family, my cousins that all come out, help me with all the cars, the late models, short trackers, vintage cars, everything we got. Have a great time, and thank you to everybody that lets me do this. Sweet. All right, last question. Are we going to see you for National Short Track Championships? Oh, you never know what car I'll decide to bring out. All right. Congratulations, sir. Once again, make some noise. It's fearless. Frank Beldowski. Let me go to the other guy now. And in the stocker division, in the 57 Chevy, let's make some noise for this driver. It's Hacksaw, Pat Heaney. Hacksaw, come on over here. I love this car. This, this car is awesome. How long have you been racing this 57 Chevy? Actually, this is my second time in the car this year. Uh, I've had it all year, but uh, my health has kept me from racing it. We normally run it at Slinger, and a guy named Gary Lamont or Danny Church Jr. has been driving it. So uh, we raced it at the Dells earlier this year and then tonight. You guys put on a great show tonight. Uh, do you got any of the sponsors you'd like to thank, sir? I'd like, to sponsor, I'd like to thank every one of them. Oak Creek Automotive, Cost Manufacturing, SJS Construction and Roofing, um, Von Bond Products, Bergie's Pub and Prime, Purpose Contracting, KO Designs. God, I hope I'm not forgetting anybody. <laughs> I think you got them all. Dick, Dick Kath. Oh, yes. Dick Kath, who raced here for many, many years, good friend of mine, came here tonight to be my backup driver in case I couldn't go. But fortunately, my wife packed me enough tile and all to get through the night, so. All right. Well, once again, congratulations, sir. Make some noise once again, Rockford Speedway. It's Hacksaw, Pat. Heaney. All right. Miller Lite American short tracker feature on tap coming up next.